Okay, hello everybody and welcome back to Dragon Age 2. So we've got some important things to talk about really quick. Um, I'm actually just adjusting my headphones and stuff right now. But, um, so I just read your guys' comments from, I think, part episode 8 or whatever, when, uh, like 7 and 8, when we meet Fenris and then we do the romance option. And a lot of you were saying that it is, you know, if you support the mages at all, it is impossible to friendship Fenris. And you guys aren't going to see this one for like another week or so. Um, I, I'm almost tempted to upload three a day because I'm like, I want you guys to see this. But, um, yeah, it's, uh, it's a bit of a conundrum because I was kind of, what I was hoping for with the, with the friendship thing was to kind of like make him relax his attitude a bit on mages, but I don't think that's the case. I think what's, what would happen is that it would look like I support mages being downtrodden and I know some people mention they're like don't 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 be deceived by his calm voice like he has a huge hatred for mages and I was like yeah I'm not really seeing that yet because he's very calm about it and he does make some good points and you guys will probably get kind of sick of me like doing restarts and stuff because in the last little bit I was trying and let's see uh where is he at right now yeah see I get he's more neutral than anything else at this point, which is bad. And now a lot of people have said that neutrality is bad. Not bad, it's just not fun, you know what I mean? Um, so what I think I'm actually going to have to do is go down the rival path with Fenris because I think my hawk does support mages. I think she thinks he makes good points and, um, you know, the mages make good points. There's no right answer. And I was actually, uh, Leon Bard, I think is how I say it, in the comments, brought up a good point that I need to think about what my hawk would want. Because I'm playing, you know, it's me, I'm playing. But it's also fun and sort of important in a role-playing game to make sure you're role-playing as the character. And I think that I kind of lost track of that. I was just like kind of, I'm just kind of like barreling through everything and I'm enjoying it, but I'm not really giving my hawk a chance to be herself. So I need to look at conversations and situations and say, what would my hawk say or think? And I think, and I was, I was kind of editing, and as I was editing some of the stuff, I was looking at any patterns and stuff that have come up, because I have tried to keep her, you know, kind of on a pattern and stuff, and she is, like, sarcastic and charming or whatever, but I think what I've kind of got for her in my head right now is that she's not really into the whole nobility thing, but she does appreciate money. Like, that's, she's, she's not too proud, like, with the Thenril a little bit ago, we, like, did the whole, you know, I'm not too proud. Pride has never been my downfall or whatever. And I think she'd make a bad noble because of that. And that's fine. I think she doesn't mind, like, her her origins. She's not, like, proud. I'm like, I'm a peasant or whatever. She's just one woman trying to keep her family alive and trying to keep herself alive, you know? She's the eldest. She's supposed to support her family at this point. That's what she's, that's why she, you know, she's in, she wants money because she wants to be able to keep them safe and fed and everything, and it's her responsibility. And she's a jokester and a trickster, and I like that. She, uh, she likes to mess with people, I think, so I think the rivalry route isn't going to be bad. And I know everyone's been saying that, but I've had a really hard time coming to terms with that. Um, I think there are some rivalries that would be bad, but I don't, I don't know. Like, I'm just, what I'm going to have to do from now on is not go, oh, but I want this character to like me. I'm going to have to say, well, what would my hawk think? Would she want to just smack him upside the head with her words or what? You know what I mean? So, so we will see. And Fenris isn't locked in as my romance at this point. Um, I don't think, Meryl is too much like a little sister for me at this point. So I don't know, but I don't, so I don't think she's on the radar, really. So far, it's actually Anders and Fenris, and I know we're getting more characters later. Um, I don't think, I don't think Aveline actually is an option, which is fine, because I wouldn't want to romance Aveline either. Um, yeah, Bethany's my sister. Um, but yeah, no, I'm gonna try and kind of make sure, I, I mean, I have been, but not as much. I haven't been... I've been kind of focusing on other aspects of the game instead of, like, Hawk, you know? 
And and like uh, a couple people have said, you know, it's like this is a story. This isn't a story about some hero come to save the day on the wings of a griffin or whatever. Like, she's had to work. She had a good life, but she's had to work her way up from the bottom on Kirkwall. And she's not just she's not trying to save the world or solve any problems. She's just trying to she's trying to get money for a deep roads expedition to go make sure that her family has a safe place to stay. You know, and while she couldn't really care less about the nobility thing, her family does, so she's going to support them in that, you know? Um, but yeah, I, I, I kind of like the, I mean, I know you're in the sarcastic routes, and maybe that's why I kind of like this idea, but I like the idea of her being sort of a trickster, you know? Um, willing to kind of poke people, willing to do, she's kind of an adrenaline junkie. I think she likes to prove herself in a way. And like, if she gets paid for it, great, you know, but may not prove herself, but I think she just, she likes taking risks. She likes adrenaline rushes. So we'll see. That's, that's what I'm kind of thinking right now. Um, I really don't want to keep playing too far ahead, but I also really want to play this game, <laughs> but I waited today until I got your guys' comments, a bunch of them at least from, uh, from the episodes that I had just uploaded. And I'm actually uploading right now. I'm uploading 9 and 10, so. But maybe. I mean, we'll definitely work. I'm gonna try to get. Oh, yeah, I was gonna do that because someone did mention, and I was thinking about it yesterday, that uh, maybe if I did this, I wouldn't get attacked so much at night. So maybe we'll do that first. But we also have. Okay. So, and I don't know, I know she's a warrior, but I feel like her smuggler nature, or whatever, the, 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 the whatever reason she chose the smugglers, what is gonna, it's gonna affect her, you know? She's, she's gonna take any opportunity she can to make some money, and that's why she's willing to do this Deep Roads expedition, because anybody in their right mind wouldn't, but, um, well, maybe not, but, you know, it, it's, it's very dangerous, so. But we'll do the, this one. Uh, where is that at? Leave. Hi, town. Oh, yeah, I was like, what? But we, is it the dock? No, not the docks. Um, okay. No, it's not that one either. Is it? Oh, is it night? Okay, that's why. The docks? Loose, no. Low Town. It's Low Town. Was it? Oh, God. I don't know. I think it was. I think it was the Low Town guys. I totally lost track of it, what I was thinking. But yeah, I appreciate your guys' comments. You guys, have, you guys have really helped me out, and I'm trying really hard to not be a dweeb about all this. Um, let's make sure. Nope, I don't want you. I want you. Yeah, you're on the far end. Okay. I thought they might say something. Uh, maybe I should I stop? What are we doing? Oh, no, Aveline is good for this because we're gonna be taking out guys. Um, can I? Should I bring Varric? No, okay, but I do think I'm gonna have to start working down the rivalry path for Fenris. I don't know if I mentioned that, but I think I am gonna try to do that. Or, not even try. Like, it's not gonna be hard, you know? And he does make good points, you know? So, like, about mages. But, so does Anders, you know? And it, and it just seems kind of strange that somebody who fought so hard for his freedom, that Fenris, who fought so hard for his freedom, would be okay with people being practically, where am I going, practically enslaved, you know? So, but he's got an extreme bias, and I have to, I can only assume that he has depths of anger that I haven't seen yet, because he seems like a pretty reasonable sort, except for the fact that anytime I'm even remotely nice to mages, he gets upset, so it's probably not going to be too hard for me to get his rivalry, I guess. I was worried that maybe I'd gone too far, but we're still in pretty neutral ground. Hey, holy crap. <laughs> and then... Nope, nope, nope. Oh, that was too far away, dang it. Did 
Somebody just summon a demon? No? Okay. Alright, I'm gonna pay attention to this guy. Where am I? Where am I? Oh, whoa, I like totally lost track of myself. Must finish this! Oh, you're dead. Whoa, you're dead. What? Oh, no, dang, where'd you come from? Please! Let's finish it! Okay. What do you think, Aveline? It. If the deep roads is what you want. Right, I do. I have that. Um. Also, someone said that I might have an easier time with the camera if I turn on auto attack. So we'll see. We'll test that out. I don't really like the idea of auto attack, but. Um, it, it, we'll see. I'll, I'll have to mess with it and see if I like it or not. Okay, so Aveline didn't care about that. Shoot. Oh well. <laughs> Fuck! You're awesome! Okay, uh, wait, no, not inventory. I don't care about inventory. I just want to play the game. Last of his line. Okay, we can eliminate Card of Thugs and the Red Blossom. They are lurking throughout the docks. Oh, how pleasant. Whoa. All right, well, where's my house? Gamlin's house is this way? I might, tra or am I guess, I guess I'm close to the hangman too. I could trade people out, but. I kind of want to bring, um, hmm. I do want to bring Fenris because just in case we encounter any mages and I happen to be all like, woohoo, you know. Kind of want to get started on that rivalry thing, I guess. I don't, I don't think I had any letters. I need to like sit back. Jeez. I'm like leaning forward. Hey, puppy! You good? Okay. Everybody should be good. Oh, right! I, uh, wait, no, I, 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 I also wanted to come here because I, oh, I logged in on my account, and I don't see anything on this, but, uh, that's okay. It might just not be right now, you know? I don't know why this is still here. Ha, <laughs> I believe you are in dire need of some coin. Well, not anymore, but thanks. Okay. Um. I do want to bring Varric, so let's bring... Well, what were we going to do, maybe? Um. Anders? No, let's not bring Fenris. Let's bring... Anders and Meryl. Barrick, Anders, Fenders, no, Barrick, Anders, Meryl. Yeah. This is a happy crew. Um, let's do that. Wait, what was the one we were doing where we were getting like blood magicked? What's that all about? What was that all about? Let me even look. Um, 
wasn't that. Oh, I do need to get Isabel. I didn't look up anything about a bug or something. Maybe we should get Isabella. Oh, was no, what was it? I can't remember now. What was the one where we were? Hmm. Enemies among us? No. Was that that? That wasn't that. That was something else. No, it was. It was that. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um. Well, maybe we'll actually go get Isabella because it would be nice to have more people. Yeah. We'll see if this works. It may not. But she's up here. If, if I still... Because I fought the guys and then I couldn't find anything and it was weird and then I just kind of gave up and did other things. Alright. Let's... Oh, so it auto saved when we got here, though, so we shouldn't we shouldn't have any troubles if we have any troubles. Where are we? Oh, there you are. Oh, there you are. Yep. I don't. That's the. Got her. Okay. Oh, it's doing the auto attack thing. Hader sent them. Search uh. the bodies. I need to find out why. Yay! Hiding in the chantry and sending thugs to finish me off. Coward. Wow. He'll not get away with this. Come on. Come on, let's go. How can you run faster than me? If we can follow her. Usually, they boop. They boop away. You know. Oh, there's more. Someone just jumped in on me. Now you fall! Oh, well, that's what I meant to do, I meant to do. That one. It's kind of boring to just sit here, though. I'm not even, like, hitting this person. Yeah, I might have to change it after this. My dual wielder. Ready? Oh, okay. Mm. I was gonna try and talk to her, but it didn't work that way. Isabella, should have known you'd find yeah, me here. Yeah, coward. Tell your men to burn the letters next time. <laughs> Castillon was heartbroken when he heard about the shipwreck. 
You should have let him know. That's you her husband, right? Or her ex-husband? Must have slipped my mind. <laughs> Where's the relic? <laughs> Where's the relic? I lost it. Castillon's just going to have to do without. I can't see her getting married. Lost it? Just like you lost a ship full of valuable cargo. They weren't cargo, Hader. They were people. Ah! Those slaves were worth a hundred sovereigns a head. And you let them scurry off into the wild. All right, we're already friends, and Isabella. And now the relic's gone, too. Castillon won't be happy to hear that. I promise you. Will someone explain what's going on? <laughs> Isabella's been a very bad girl. I'm gonna girl. stab you right through that. Right through your freaking big business nose. business deal and then ran away. She didn't tell you. I told her enough. I said I arranged for a duel, which I did. I also said you wouldn't play fair, which you didn't. We can talk later if you want. Right now, we have other problems. <laughs> Cassian isn't a very happy person, is he? Maybe he needs a new hobby. <laughs> There's only one way to settle this. <laughs> oh! Why'd you shoot go for her? That was stupid. Oh wait, hang on. I actually want to change it in the options. We'll see. Was it? Come on, do that one, do that one, do that one, do that one. Nope, that one. That one. Okay. Archers suck. Oh my gosh, there's more coming in! No, focus on this guy. Come on! Alright, shit! Okay, nope, I need a help. Okay. Here we go. Got you. Freaking heck, you guys are annoying! Done? I picked up something on accident. Not done? Where? Oh, behind us because they spawn in because they're demons. Get off my friend. Get off my friend. Ah. Anders is really good. Or no, and it's Meryl too. That's why we have so much magic flying around. Stab first, ask questions later. Yeah. Trust me. It's better this way. <laughs> Castillon won't hear about me from Hader, but he'll find me eventually. You shouldn't wear white. I just have to get him the relic. It's simple as that. What's so interesting about the relic? I don't really know what it is, except that it's ancient I and want worth it. my weight in I gold. want it. Castillon has me chasing it down as payback for freeing his oh, slaves. Oh, okay. To be honest, I think he just wants me dead. But that would be letting me off easy. Well, why don't we just kill him? Who is Castillon? He's a powerful merchant based in Antiva. I believe he has ties to the Felicissima Armada. Felicissima. I used to work for him. But the job's she mostly really sound involved Antiven. smuggling lyrium, jewels, or the occasional criminal acquaintance. He paid well. Who's lucky? You hired Lucky Oh yeah, that guy in the bar. The That's right. He insisted he knew everything that was going on in Kirkwall. He lied. <laughs> I bet he doesn't even know everything going on in his pants. <gasps> Yikes! Did you end up in Kirkwall because your ship was destroyed? There was a storm. The ship ran aground on the reefs near the city. I managed to make it to shore. Most of my men weren't as lucky. You're the captain. You were Poor supposed sucks. to go down with the ship. I knew some of those men almost ten years. Oh, balls. <laughs> yeah. I mean, yeah. I mean, you don't really want to just die, but you think everybody's right behind you and you turn around and they're not, you know? What's this about you freeing slaves? I was asked to escort Castillon's cargo ship. I got a bad feeling about the job partway through. Boarded the ship to find slaves. Nearly 200. Wow. Elves, humans, children even. It was sickening. 
They paid Castillon to take them away oh from the blight. Oh my gosh! They took their money and sold them into slavery. Oh my gosh! Even I can see that's wrong. Jeez, yeah, this guy is a dirtbag. Uh, I, I will help you. If getting the relic gets Wait, Castillon no. off your uh, back, then I'll help you retrieve it. I still don't know where I actually it is, want to kill Castillon. You'll be the first to know if I hear anything. Anyway, thanks for helping me out with Hader. I think I'll tag along for a while. There might be something I could do for you. Okay. And I have a room at the Hanged Man if you're looking for <laughs> company later. Yeah, okay. She like walks up, turns around, walks as she says it. Oh, that's funny. Uh oh, do we have it looks like we may have the full complement now. I know there's one more we can get for a DLC, but um hmm um let's take I bet you these guys would have interesting things to say <laughs> uh, yeah why not why not although I probably should go talk to her I don't know where she gonna be though the bodice ripper. Oh, isn't that just sound like a lovely thing to have in my hands? Sorry, Chantry, about the uh, dead people around. Where? Oh, she's in the tavern. Okay, we'll go. We'll go check the tavern. Maybe I shouldn't have. Uh, maybe I can. I think I can talk to her if she's still in my crew. But there's a there's a changey outy thing in there. So there's a, a crew changer. So. Uh, yeah, we're going... Is there something? I guess I haven't really looked around at the shops at night. I don't know... Oh, that's... Oh, oh, I was like gonna go look for the shops. Okay. I don't think anything's changed. What are you guys doing? You look suspicious. What's over there? I don't know what's over there. High Town Estate. Have I wandered around up here? I don't know. Oh, I guess though we can go to Fenris's and uh, change people out. And I am nervous about missing any conversation options with people, so I'll just, whenever I'm around, I guess I'll just double check. I kind of assume that things would change if people were, or if a big event happened, so if like one person had something to say, they all would, but I do know I gotta go talk to Isabella, so. We should move on. Okay. But yeah, we'll change him out really quick. Where? Oh, there it is. Okay, so take off Isabella. <clears throat> Excuse me, and put it in Meryl's room. Yeah. You gotta, you guys gotta protect me so uh, Isabella doesn't jump me. I get that feeling. I got a feeling. I'm high on believing. Where am I going to the hanged man during the daytime? I'm like super thirsty today. Oh, do uh, you guys say anything in here? You have been a good ah. friend. Better than I deserve. <laughs> Alright. Edwina right. is the meanest waitress I've ever met. Awfully but noisy. She keeps my drink. Oh, there I she is. I love her. Oh. He went into the back room for another keg of ale one day and never returned. So you be careful going back there. I promise. If I go back there, I won't be alone. <laughs> Shake it off. Maker. I think he's ignoring me now. <laughs> hey, is my coin not good enough for you? Oh, hook. I have a problem I had. You going to buy me a drink to celebrate our victory? You drink the swill here. It's an acquired taste. Uh huh. Oh, before I forget. Sorry, I just saw my computer kind of sketch, so now I'm freaking because out. Because I have a friend who needs some help. A friend? Is this a friend or a 
friend. No, I never what? Let him steer my ship, if that's what you're asking. So is Point that what I'm idea, asking? He doesn't have good control of his rudder. His Okey name's dokey. Martin. He has a room right here in the Hanged Man. Tell him I sent you. Now, you going to leave me to my drinking or what? Well, do you want to come with? Uh, oh, I, I got Isabella's contact. Okay, let's see. Sorry, I am kind of looking at my computer right now. I'm a little bit, I'm a little bit worried. Finders keepers. Oh, okay. So, was hers in the... Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, um, let's bring you along to go talk to him then. So, we'll take out Meryl and put in Isabella. Oh, let's see. Let's see. This is a talking spot. Ah, move. It was this <laughs> big. <laughs> There's no way. Impossible. I've had hundreds of those in my hands, and they're never that <laughs> size. Would I lie about something so critical? <laughs> I can't tell <laughs> What are you two talking about? We're just yeah. Yeah. Well, daggers, technically. I never remember the difference. <laughs> Why? What did you think we were talking about? <laughs> oh, that's a good one. I was like, I know it's not what it sounds like, but it's what it sounds like for a reason. Hello, sad man. Ooh, Hi. He's got scars on his you? neck. My, you're jumpy. Look at you, cowering in a corner. What happened to the fearless, dashing raider I used to know? I'm not a raider anymore, Isabella. I'm just an honest merchant now. Please, Martin. You wouldn't know honest if I tied you up and spanked you with it. <laughs> you tie him up. I'll go find some <laughs> Very funny, Isabella. You said you could find me help. This is the best I'm you great. could do, eh? Yes, why don't we insult the people coming to help? <laughs> that will work out wonderfully. <laughs> you want the help or not? Yes, I Nothing want help. His neck. I need someone to help me find out where the raiders have hidden my stolen cargo. This job's as easy as a peg-legged tavern wench. And there's good coin in it to boot. Uh... What did the raiders do to you? They closed in on my ship and forced her into the cliffs. My crew and I barely made it out alive. They must have salvaged the cargo when it washed us all. Okay. Why would the raiders want your cargo? Is it valuable? How should I know why they want it? It's just spices and herbs. Nothing special. <laughs> you used to be a raider. What happened? Yes, I was a raider. Back then it was just smuggling and petty thievery. It's changed since that madman Ianto took Didn't power Didn't I just kill him? <clears throat> Extortion, murder, kidnapping. He does it all. It's just not to my taste. I tried to get out, but he didn't like that. This scar on my neck, he gave it to me. <gasps> Slipped my throat and threw and me overboard. And he's still alive? I tried to start How did you live? this bullshit. And he has his men chase me down and steal my cargo. <laughs> and you're <laughs> perfectly innocent of wrongdoing, aren't you? Are the raiders a big problem around here? They've got some big oh. plan for Kirkwall, or so I've heard. If they're not a problem now, they will be soon. Okay. It's your cargo. You know it. Those raiders are still looking for me. I'm not going to draw their okay, attention. Okay, I think we got everything. Oh, yeah. I'll take care of it. You'll need to look around the docks. The crates bear the seal of the Orlesian Port Authority. Oh, so you'll know it when you see it. You're I know, I don't know what it looks like. The Port Authority seal looks like. <laughs> it's fancy. Just like everything, all easy. Okay. I've had it with the Raiders. And this cargo is the key to me getting yeah, on the he's straight like, and narrow. narrowed his eyes. You're doing me a huge favor here, friend. Thank you. And be careful. Okay. Okay. All right. 
All right then. Okay, let's uh, level up uh, Isabella. Oh, wait, no. Abilities. All right, you're a dual wielder. Uh, okay. And do you have anything special? Swashbuckler. Oh, okay. Um, okay, well, what does she have? She has that one way back. Okay, so she got stealth and evade. Okay. But she's got this, and I have six ability points to give her. Wait, okay, uh... Oh. Uh, can we use combo? Or we do. Oh, that's cool. Oh, okay. Oh, it cools down more quickly. Well, let's get uh, that and that. That, uh, what does this do? Oh, yeah, let's do that, jeez. And, what's one of these? Oh, shoot. Oh! Okay, but less damage is not good. What's that? Requires savvy? Oh, requires both of them. Oh! Well... I kind of want to get that, actually. Oh, whoa, okay. Well, let's- okay, let's look at these. So we have, um... So it requires both of these, and then we can get that one. Requires a higher level than what she's got. But let's give her... One, two... Three. That looks pretty good to me. Alright. Alright. So our Anders... I don't know if Anders and Isabella are gonna get along. That'll be interesting. Um, but I will call this one here. I guess we'll, we will finish... Or we'll, we'll, we'll do her... We'll do this for her. But I think we also have... Yeah, we have the docks down there, too. So... Probably we'll bring... We'll probably, I'll probably keep who we've got, to be honest. So, anyway, uh, that's interesting. So, hopefully the beginning wasn't too weird for you guys, where I was like, oh, let me just wax poetic about things, but... So, I am trying to kind of keep more in mind what Hawk would do. Um, as opposed to me just trying to make sure people like me. Because I know that it's not, it's not gonna happen. Not everybody is gonna be friendshipy with me and rivalry isn't bad but if you have a good rivalry it's great but i think some rivalries can be poisonous so well we'll see i'm 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 just gonna play it how hawk would play it and we'll just see how it turns out so um thank you guys again i'll see you in the next one